Hello everybody, my name is Marcus and I am a part of Cisco Technical Enablement Engineers team and in this video I will be showing you the latest and greatest version of CCA CCA 3.1, yes it's finally out and guess what, it has almost all of the things that you partners have been crying, kicking and screaming about and in this video uh, I will tell you what those improvements are and uh, I'll show you where they are so this is a short video uh, this is just so that uh, when you guys download the CCA you don't have to fumble through every single drawer to see what's in there I'll just show you the cool stuff so uh, I'll start off with the most requested one which is uh, adding a 9 or whatever number you like to the number that that comes into your system so a lot of you have asked for the ability where a user or someone will call into the phone system and when they hit edit dial they'll have to add a 9 well under callback rules uh, if the digit well I'll show you so if you have a number that comes in and it's 10 digits which is usually uh, without a 1 you'll add the callback rule and it'll be right here you'll just add a 9 and a 1 if it comes in as 11 digits which is usually the number plus a 1 you'll only add a 9 and as soon as you hit apply and OK uh, it will add that for you so when you go to your directories or miss calls you'll just hit dial the next big one as you can see is the SG300 switches um, they are now uh, fully configurable, well I'm, I wouldn't say fully, but they are now configurable through CCA. So uh, when you go through your smart ports, um, as you can see, you can set it up as, as different roles. You'll just hit modify and uh, you'll be able to modify those ports. Next up we have Meet Me Unlocked. This was another big one so now when you unlock meet me you can set up a direct in dial number to go directly to the meet me conference number 771 and people can join your meeting without you having to start it that's under conferencing another huge one I should have started off with this one first background images now this is so simple to do a caveman can do it if you like to add background images make sure you're uploading a PNG file once you add it um, CCA will configure it make it the right size and add it so that when you scroll through and check your background it will be there Next feature, uh, template editor. Oh, you guys are going to love this one. Um, where should I start? So this is for many of you who have asked for the ability to create your own templates because maybe, let's say, you have a lobby phone and you don't want the, I guess, the user to put, I don't know, calls on hold. You don't want them to park. You don't want them to transfer. You don't want them to do anything but place a call. Um, here you'll set up what happens when the phone is ringing, when the call is connected, uh, when the phone is idle, you know, any any ring state or any state. Uh, you can remove the, the services URL, you can set up uh, languages for the phone, um, deny web access, many different things. So you'll end up with a phone, if you're a security uh, geek, you'll end up with a phone looking like this where they can only press new call and once they place the call their only option is to end the call so you'll edit the template through the template editor once you're done you will go to the template assignment waiting for it to load up here Please don't take forever. So 
So once you're in template assignment, you'll go to the phone and you'll just select what template number it gets. And that's it. Simple as that. Um, what else did I have here for you? Oh, here's another huge one. Alright, I went through it too quick. Once you go to voicemail, uh, you go to mailboxes. Many of you have asked for the ability to, so that when users, you know, get into your mailbox, or are about to leave a message, um, they should have the ability to press zero to transfer to an operator. Or maybe you're malicious and you just want to, um, you know, play goodbye. So when they press zero, you know, they end the call. Um, we have many different options here. Um, so just remember, this is under voicemail. Users can now call your voicemail and press different buttons to go to different places. So that was the uh, the last feature I had to show you guys. Hopefully this video will uh, steer you away from going through every single um, option here. But hey, you can if you want to. And I uh, just wanted to say thanks to the CCA team. They are doing a great job. Um, your feedback is also very important on the support community. So keep it coming, guys. And uh, that's about it. Stay tuned for more.